Hi guys, um, I want to talk about a really uh, simple concept that can really, if you put it in your game, can add um, a lot of con more consistency in your shots, um, more accuracy, and even maybe 20% more power to your shots. And um, I like to call this, or my coach has called it, spotting the ball onto the racket. <clears throat> so the concept is say for um, a backhand counter hit, you hold the racket where the ball would hit it. So the ball is going to bounce here and it's going to hit here. So you hold it there for as long as possible and then you do the stroke. So you line it up, stroke. So the ball would hit it, you're spotting the ball onto the racket and then you go through it. So um, you can do this in all strokes. Um, Spot the ball onto the racket, boom. Spot the ball on the racket, boom. Spot the ball on the racket, boom. Um, for the flick, you could hold the. Uh, I noticed someone told me when the Japanese are learning to flick, they do this position and they let the ball hit the racket. So they just hold the ball, um, hold, hold the racket where the ball would hit it. And I, someone told me they do it for half an hour to learn this concept of. Um, what I call spotting the ball on the racket. So what does it do? Um, it delays the backswing. So um, it's probably easiest to see in a backhand. <clears throat> the modern backhand is very short and uh, whippy. So you spot the ball on the racket as long as possible. In the last minute, boom, spot the ball on the racket, boom. Um, you might bring it back a bit, but it's still this concept of delaying the backswing. You want a very fast, whippy stroke, so you have to wait. You have to delay the backswing. Now, that might seem um, logical on the backhand, but for the forehand, you can do the same. As you're rotating, you don't bring it back too early. You wait, 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 and then last minute, you whip forward. So you're getting more of this whippy action going because um, you're delaying. Um, the pro is it's such a fast game, you know, you mightn't see this that actually delaying, but a slower ball, you might actually see it. So if you practice that on the forehand, well, um, you'll probably find your, your uh, power goes up 20% because you're getting a faster, really using your um, whip action. You're going faster. The faster you go back into a whip, faster, and your body goes forward and then it whips forward. The racket speed goes up a lot. So you can do it on a block even. Wait, 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 boom. Wait, 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 boom. Wait, 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 boom. Wait, 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 boom. And so you're sort of lining up the bat where you want the ball to go. It makes the shots more reliable and delays the backswing. This tip really does um, work. I find it's really effective in um, backspin. My backhand, I do, wait, 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 boom, wait, 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 boom. Instead of going back early, if you go back early, like it's a lot harder. Just spot the ball, boom. It really, um, if I'm inconsistent in my backhand, open up, I'll say, oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> um, so um, try this tip, you know, it's um, pretty easy to uh, add to your games delaying the backswing, and uh, I think it's extremely important. Um, I hope you get something out of my videos. If you like them, press the like and subscribe, please. Um, and thanks for watching.